Let's just say non bricklayers built it. He was never happy with it, so he's knocked it down himself. Contacted us and asked us to come and rebuild it for him. Mm. Footing's a bit iffy, so I'll actually just cut a few of these other face brick down to get them in. West brick like multi. Never heard of them, but they're going to make a nice wall anyway. And we're done. And uh, summer's back. What's the date, Alex? About 20th of August. I think so. Yeah. Yeah, summer's back. Got sun cream on again. Uh, we're on this job now. This is in the gull for uh, one of our views called, called Dougie. And um, there was a wall here originally. I'll insert the picture of it, which um, let's just say non bricklayers built it. He was never happy with it, so he's knocked it down himself. Contacted us and asked us to come and rebuild it for him. So uh, yeah, he stripped it all down, cleaned it all off, we've loaded out, got a mix in. Looks a bit chaotic at the moment, but yeah, as you can see, a little bit of footpath, enough for footpath left for anybody. Um, footing's a bit iffy, so I'll actually just cutting a few of these with the face brick down to get them in. And these are the brick. Um, they like, they are actually an Ibstock Ravenhead Hearted Red Rustic. But they have like um, a coating on them, it takes the edge off them, I'll show you, just find the name. West Brick Light Multi, never heard of them, but they're going to make a nice wall anyway, nice little heart in them. Very similar to the house brick as well, which are the red rustics. We've not got a lot of battery today, so it's going to be a bit too much, a bit too much um, time lapse. So I was just running that bottom course in. The trusty trench blocks in, ready for the the uh, Blake's profile to go on. A so brick and half pillar this end, straight wall. So, um, let's get cracking. Get this, get this all set out, and go and have a quick break.
Right, um, Monday morning, about quarter to eight, uh, back at my goal. And we remembered the charging cable for the camera today, so we'll be able to film a lot more. Uh, we had a good day when we were here last Friday. Yeah, we got the bulk of the wall up and started the brick and edge, so we've got the two corners set up. And uh, so we've just got the brick and edge to do on the front wall and then the whole of the, the side wall, which is pretty much the same size wall. So I'll take show you what we've done. There's Alex. There we go. We just did a straight joint from wall to wall instead of two in it because it's because it's different bricks. So that's ready for its brick and edge. There we go. So same again here. All nicely cleaned up for us. Got a few brick down on Friday. Just use the mortar up. We're all loaded, so we're we're probably an hour and a half ahead of ourselves that we were on Friday. So hopefully that good start, we'll get everything done today. Well, we're gonna get everything done today, hopefully before a decent hour. So yeah, we're all set up, plenty of spare bricks, plenty of sand, got an extra bag of cement just in case, customer got that over the weekend for us, Dougie. Uh, so all that's left to do is get a mix on, get the profile set up on the trench block, like we did on here, and then uh, get cracking. Rolling. Okay. Filming on the time lapse. Hmm? Filming on the time lapse. Oh, sorry. Filming on the time lapse. We're filming now. Right. I just wanted like a quick shot to just like put in the middle of like the mortar disappearing off the board. Oh, yeah. Be a bit artsy. We need some cream on it now. Yeah. Well, I do anyway. Real quick one. These are the feather bricks with the uh, the right and the wrong side. So, looking at the feather edgings, that's the right way. If you want to learn more about that, we've got a video on the right side and wrong side of bricks. Check it out if you want to uh, learn more about how to set a brick. And these are a bit more confusing, so because they're a bit smoothish on the face, check the ends if you're not sure. Yeah, so like sometimes it's a bit harder to tell, like with um, 
say this one for example. So the sides usually offer better uh, better guide on which is the right way. So yeah, if, there's an, if you want to learn how to set them the correct way down, check out that video. There'll be a link in the description. So make sure you do that. Put a link to the video in the description. Maybe, maybe edit on my bit so there's a link then. Right, time check, 25 to 10. So we've got three on, got it all set out leveled. Uh, it's not quite level yet. We, we, I think it's probably 20 mil out of level on the footing. So we're working four to 300 here, four to a foot down there. So every 75 mil on this course, every three inches on that course, and we'll soon pick it up level by the time we get to the top. So that's a third of it up now. There's only nine courses on this side, <coughs> so we've got one, two, three, four, six left, brick and edge, <coughs> blues, and then three extras on the pillars. So, um, yeah, the, uh, we've got ourselves a good start, we're not doing so bad. <coughs> Just going to have a quick brew now, and try and keep the momentum going. Try and get it all done before it's stupid o'clock. So we'll see after brew. There's a quick one in our um, instant corner setup, trench block. I know it's bedded on the tarmac, but that will be cleaned up after when we're done. Get your first three courses on, on the block, and while you get them three on, the block's gone off. 
and whack the, whack the blakes on. That's it then. Just run it in. And this end we've got just a catheter piece of batten nailed in. Got a gauge mark down. So no corners, just straight running in, which saves a lot of time. I think I'm filming. I think you are, yeah. Cool. It's a nice close up, they'll have my face. <laughs> Missed a couple of cross joints out there, are they the old ones? Probably the old ones, aren't they? Sure. Right, I can't listen to the radio while this is on. But I can listen to it on my phone. Let's get my sun cream on first. Two fifteen. One brick. Hey. Just talk to the camera. Oh. Put your line in, please, Al. Oh. There you go. Alex is up. Again, not too tight. Okay. There you go, sorted. Fits brick strikes again. This is a little just a little thing we do is put a tie wire in just to take the line off the face of the brick. So there we go.
I won't wait till they get the line. Dogs, go on. Hey. Why? It's not on your playlist, is it? Uh, no. <laughs> oh, so it's not dogs. Can't beat a bit of Titanic anyway. Watching the film. Yeah. Keep them tight, mate, because he's big. Yeah. Pull us underneath. I was the whole joint forward, then I put one brick in, I was back. Yeah.
take the metal out. Fifteen is what we want. Pardon? Two fifteen we want. One o'clock, making good ground. We've got about 100 face bits of only now, including the pillar. One o'clock? Huh? What time is it? Half past 12. Oh, even better. Half past 12. Oh, Excellent. Yeah, we've got um, one course on top of that. Top of our face work, then our brick and edge. So one course on top of that. One on top of that, and three courses of pillar with the pier cap which is over by the house. Oh yeah I can point at the house now because I've covered the number up. Number editing numbers out. Yeah, so that'll give us the same height as this. And then once I'm on the pillar, Alex's gonna jump on the brick and edge and start on here. So by the time I've done the pillar he should be well into these and I can come and join him. That'll oh. just leave us the brick and edge this afternoon. We hope. Yeah, we hope. Um, 
There's plenty of bricks left over. There's a lot of ropey ones though, a lot of dirty ones. Yeah, I'm just trying to fill them away. There's like these mucky ones, will they be alright or? Probably best not to put them in if we've got plenty. Don't put them in. Yeah. Just stack them to one side. In fact, take the bricks off the blue, off, I'll take the ones off the blues because they're in your way. Yeah. Yeah, don't bother with those on the front. Right, we'll get this all uncovered while Alex is loading out and I'll get this mix whirling. It's about half mix left in yet. Okay. Investigation works, so diversion is that, full joints? Yeah. Well, you should point up. I hope there wasn't a diamond in this bloody wall. Stay tight. The seven is how much more he needs for the cross joints. Yeah, it can go through it.
We're gonna fit. Bang on. Hang on. Pressure's on me now, I know you're filming. Oh yeah, pressure's on. Gentle, push it towards me. Towards you. Hang on, take some of this out for you. Twenty to four, isn't it? What? It's only about twenty to four. Yeah. That's it. Done. We did. We did work late Friday to make sure we had the line shirt done, and we did a lot of messing about Friday. Today was pretty straightforward, so we blitzed it and got it done. And we might even get to the builders' merchants today if we pull our fingers out and get tidied up quick. All finished. That's what it used to look like. Better bricks, better mortar. Cement in the water. Red bricks look nice with the blues on top. Nice contrast. Nice rich colour than reds. So that's it, we're all done. Off home, ready for the next job. See you in the next one. Don't forget to give us a like, uh, drop us a comment, uh, and hit the notification bell. I forgot to say subscribe. Oh yeah, and subscribe. That, that's always helpful. Join the other 16 and a half thousand we've got. See you in the next one.